All right, guys. So you can see the tree. I, I'm not going to say it's done. Uh, I definitely need to add more leaves. The top needs to be way more bushy. It is definitely not uh, leafy enough. I want to fix like the shape on some of it. But it's coming along. Gigglepuff is definitely breeding animals right now, which as far as sheeps go is going to be interesting because I have already more pink wool than I know what to do with. Um, but the breeding cows and we're getting pigs. So that's something that's also happening. It's just really loud. The outside of it is kind of done. I added a little fairy house here. I know that we talked about doing like a little row of fairy houses along here, which I guess is something I could use all this pink wool for. We could do a line of houses over here. And then the other big thing that I did I ran out of torches, so I needed to make some more just to finish lining the top here. But I finished the glass wall, and then all the way around the outside, I did... I don't know why the inner room has to be here. I did uh, cobblestone and glass, and then I, I did a lot of loose errands. I've been playing for about three hours now. Um, and I just cleaned up where the land wasn't very smooth. I evened that out. I cleaned up. This was like down some and it wasn't even. So I cleaned up the, the gravel over there. I added a door so I could get out and get more sand. You can see that the sand all right there has been evened out so that we can see out and have like a nicer view. Plus I needed the sand to do all the glass Winky Snap's busy over here. This land back here was all uneven and it went down, I think, up to three blocks in some places. So I evened this out and then I went through and cut down all the leaves so you could see straight through to the wall. So all the leaves, have, oh dear, oh dear. All the leaves have been cleaned up too high over there. This land wasn't even, so I evened all this up. So basically, I've just done a lot of little kind of OCD work where I made, there was like three blocks I think missing right there so I've just cleaned up all of this land and made it a lot more symmetrical and even looking and just nice to walk around and be in so I think as far as bases go this is a pretty legit nice base um, we've got tons of sugar cane now stacks for days and for days and for days so we're getting everything we need this is this is turning out to be really efficient so we have done a lot of things we've finished the little fairy houses here they're not quite done we're going to put some flowers and stuff around them um, but I did finish part of the big tree here that we're gonna live in. I hate this rain like more than anything. Um, we put our bed, can't sleep because it's not night, um, and then we put all of the chests up here and they're all organized and stuff. So now what I wanna do is try to go get some watermelon. We're gonna have to venture out and find some because, oh, I had food in my inventory. <laughs> I'm smart. Um, hi. So we need to go out and find some watermelon so that when we do start going out to find fairies, we are able to more easily entice them, I guess, because you make glistening melon, which is sweeter than sugar, and they, they like that a little bit more. Oh, look at all the food. Look at all of the foods. Um, so, yes. So that's what we're going to do. Let's put some of this back. Okay. Okay. We're good. We've got food. We've got weapons. We've got armor. Okay. So I feel like we're ready. Are we ready? Is everyone ready? Let's go adventuring. I think I found a village. You just had we just had to sit here. There's the house that way. And and Winky Snap came to join us. I thought that I had had her sitting down. Apparently I have hadn't and she came to join us. So our home is, is about uh, 480 meters that way. And I, I hopped on top of this tree and I let this, the, the distance render 
and we found another village. So two things. One is I'm hoping that there are watermelons there. I don't know. I don't know if there will be. Um, I don't know. I just don't know where to look. They should be naturally spawning in biomes though, right? I mean, I can't believe that in 1.2.5 the only place to find watermelons would be in an abandoned mine shaft because that seems like bananas. That seems like bananas. You can't trade with villagers in 1.2.5. So this is 1.2.5. Watermelon seeds are only found in dungeons. Okay. So I guess we're going to have to go mining. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look in the chest. We found melon seeds. We found melon seeds. I am so excited. We found them. And now we have to get out of the cave. But we found melon seeds. Yes. 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 We found them. We found them. And now I have to find my way back out. But we made a waypoint, so it will be so much easier. Who else is excited? Who's excited? I'm excited. Anyone else excited? Good. I'm glad. Because this is totally exciting. We finally found the freaking melon seeds. We finally found the freaking melon seeds. I'm so excited. I am so excited. We found the melon seeds. So we went to the cave. We ventured far, far away, very, very many kilometers away from our home. Um, Winky Snap and I, she stayed safe outside of the cave while I adventured. And uh, we realized that we weren't going to find a village because um, they don't spawn there, which is something that I forgot in 1.2.5. So we got some goodies from the cave. Nothing that is too crazy, help, helps us too much. Um, but we do need to, now that we have the ability to do so, we do need to, um, put someone in charge of the melon farm. So as soon as we get all of this stuff organized in here and crazy and fixed, then we will, uh, put Winky Snap in charge of, of so the So now farm. let's take Winky Snap out of here. We will go over to where we're going to make her little farm, which is going to be this cute little patch right over here. So we will take all of the seeds like this. And we'll bring up all this stuff because we don't want any seeds around here because then she will, she will think that that's her responsibility and I don't want her to plant wheat. I want her to just take care of the melons. So then let's take the melons and plant those for her. And we will do that. I don't know where to put it. There, I guess, maybe. I don't know. Okay. And then we'll take this and we'll put it like here. And we'll put the hoe in it. And then we'll take some of the bone meal. And then we have to put a sign here. And the majestic watermelons. And then I should be able to right click her. And then, hey, this is your job. There we go. Now she knows. What are you doing? Okay. So now she's going to be in charge of the melons. That's going to be her job is to to take care of the melons. And as soon as they grow, she will harvest it and put it in there and she will plant more. So that, that will be her job. So now we're on our way. We've got a watermelon farm so we can do glistening melons so that we can get more fairies. We've got a wheat farm. We've got trees. We've got beds. We've got furnaces. We've got armor things are happening we're going places this is successful i feel like we've just won the internet and this is a great place to conclude this episode because next time we fight <laughs>